Hey, welcome to another Jim's Radio Check. This afternoon I am going to show you guys the Polaroid AM FM portable radio. I picked this radio up <clears throat> probably a year ago at uh, Family Dollar. It was $8. So I thought, yeah, I'd, I'd see how it is and check it out. And then I just threw it aside and never bothered with it till now. Uh, it says portable, lightweight, and durable. Uh, what's it say here? Uh, AM, FM radio, portable, battery powered. Then down there it says 3.5 millimeter jack. So I think it comes with some cheap headphones. This pocket radio from Polaroid is the perfect companion for getting news, sports, music, and more on the go. With a hype, sensitive, sensitive tuner, and telescoping antenna, you can pick up any station on the FM and AM band with crystal clear quality. This radio features a built-in speaker and includes lightweight earbuds runs on two AA batteries alright uh, let's check this thing out let's open it up comes in the box there's a uh, like a little blister pack your uh, cheap earbuds couldn't imagine that they're that good underneath here we have uh, some instructions very small okay here you go okay open it up and it gives you uh, the instructions which uh, I wouldn't think you'd really uh, <laughs> uh, have a lot to learn by this radio. I mean, it's just got a few things like a volume knob, display, power LED, LED indicator, uh, tuning knob, frequency switch. All right. You don't have to be a rocket scientist to figure this radio out. It's in this little blister tray. Here it is. Uh, I would say it's about, I don't know, three, four inches tall. Maybe about an inch thick. Got your antenna over here. On this side you got got the, uh, let's see, what is that? It says right there, is that the tuning? Uh... I think that size the volume and your earphone jack and then over here you got your tuner and your on off AM FM switch kind of lightweight the uh, tuning dial area kind of looks like uh, uh, what it, uh, those NIA radios in a way and then there's a uh, Geeson or something like that had a radio that Toddberg just in, that reviewed and it was uh it, it looked like a Mia but uh it had it had a different you know area like that uh let's see uh, you you could tune it from an uh, AM from uh, what is it five five thirty Let's see, it's my, my uh, camera's kind of blurry for some reason. There we go. From 5.30 to 1.60 on AM, 88 to 108 on FM. Uh, let's check out the size of this antenna. Oh, God, it's like, couldn't be more than 5, 6 inches at the most. Real small antenna. Okay, and then on the back... Here's a Polaroid 
frequencies it tells you two two double A batteries and then it says Southern Telcom made in China I think there's a date there too uh, 20 2018-08 that's interesting I don't see the dates on too many radios battery compartment let's put these batteries in here and give this thing a quick spin put the cover back in kind of difficult to put the there we go uh, let's just start out on FM I'll raise the antenna there okay turns it on let's see where's the FM exit on the top okay FM's in the middle It's hard to see in here. It's kind of dark out today. You got your little tuning light, I guess. Yeah, FM's not all that good. I mean, I got some of the close by channels in, but that's about it. Let's try AM. Drop the antenna. Well, look how far that station. It's the selectivity sucks. Look how far over it goes. Um, and they they just do a, a great. I'm not even sure how accurate this dial is. I don't know. This thing's not all that good. I mean, you get your your basic close channels, and they come booming in and take up a lot of the band space. Uh, it wasn't even worth the eight bucks I paid for it. So uh, I tell you guys what, man, I really wouldn't recommend this radio. I mean, there's so many other better ones out there. So. Uh, I I couldn't give this radio more than a three, and that's only because it turns on and plays. But uh, yeah, it's it's pretty much junk. 
So, uh, anyway, uh, thanks for watching, and again, 73s, and we'll catch you next time.